The New Zealand Army uses a rank system that is similar to that of the British Army and the armies of other Commonwealth nations. The rank system forms the backbone of the army's structure and defines the role of commissioned and non-commissioned personnel and the degree of responsibility they hold. In this video, we will review all the ranks of the New Zealand Army, from lowest to highest order of seniority. The lowest rank of a trained soldier in the New Zealand Army is the rank of private. An individual's trade title is sometimes interchanged with the rank of private, and soldiers may be given the title of sapper, gunner, trooper, signaller, or even craftsman depending on their regiment or corps. Soldiers in the rank of private do not wear a rank insignia. The next rank above private is Lance Corporal, or Lance Bombardier for those serving in the Royal Regiment of New Zealand Artillery. This rank is the lowest non-commissioned officer rank in the New Zealand Army. A Lance Corporal is usually the second in command of a section and is in control of the gun group in an infantry section. The insignia for this rank consists of one chevron. Next in ascending order of seniority is the rank of Corporal or Bombardier for those serving in the Royal Regiment of New Zealand Artillery. The New Zealand Army awards this rank to soldiers after about six or seven years of service. They usually command a section or small team and work closely with their sergeants. Holders of this rank wear an insignia featuring two chevrons. Sergeant. Promotion to sergeant in the New Zealand Army usually happens after about nine to ten years of service. Sergeants command considerable responsibility and are typically second in command of a troop or platoon. The rank of sergeant can be identified by three chevrons. Above the rank of sergeant is staff sergeant. Similar to the rank of sergeant, staff sergeants may serve as the troop or platoon second in command. Staff sergeants command more authority than sergeants and they usually assist and advise junior officers. The insignia for staff sergeants features three chevrons below a crown. Above staff sergeant is Warrant Officer Class 2. A Warrant Officer Class 2 may serve as a company, squadron, or battery sergeant major. They also serve as advisors to their unit's commanding officer. Holders of this rank wear a rank insignia with a crown surrounded by a wreath. Warrant Officer Class 1. This is the highest rank for non-commissioned personnel in the New Zealand Army. The Sergeant Major of the Army and Regimental Sergeant Majors hold this rank. Holders of this rank serve as advisors and are also charged with welfare, leadership and discipline responsibilities. A Warrant Officer Class 1 wears an insignia with the New Zealand coat of arms. Next in ascending order of seniority are the ranks for New Zealand Army commissioned officers. The lowest rank for an officer holding a commission in the New Zealand Army is the rank of second lieutenant. This rank is obtained upon graduating from officer cadet school at the Wairu military camp. In this rank, officers continue with specific training with their units, after which they are responsible for leading soldiers. Second lieutenants wear an insignia with one pip. Above second lieutenant is the rank of lieutenant. Promotion to lieutenant comes with increased responsibility and experience. Officers usually serve in this rank for about two years before receiving a promotion. A lieutenant usually serves as a platoon or troop commander and can be identified by a rank insignia with two pips. Above lieutenant is the rank of captain. Holders of this rank are usually second in command of a subunit. They are vital to the planning and decision-making process in terms of operations, equipment maintenance and logistic support. Captains wear a rank insignia with three pips. The next rank in order of seniority is the rank of major. Majors usually hold command of a subunit and are charged with the responsibility of training, leadership, and welfare of those under their command. 
The insignia for the rank of major is a crown. Lieutenant Colonel. Officers in this rank are usually unit commanders. They are responsible for the overall operational effectiveness of their units, including welfare, discipline and military capability. Lieutenant Colonels wear an insignia, with a crown above a pip. Above Lieutenant Colonel, is the rank of Colonel. Holders of this rank usually serve as staff officers, while some may have command appointments. They also serve as advisors to senior officers on the staff, and those in operational commands. Colonels wear an insignia, with a crown above two pips. Above Colonel, is the rank of Brigadier. Brigadiers are usually in command of formations, but they may also fill senior appointments on the Army staff. This rank is also known as a one-star rank, and holders wear an insignia, with a crown and three pips. Major General Major Generals are usually Division Commanders, and are also known as Two-Star Generals. This rank is usually held by the Vice Chief of the Defence Force, Commander of Joint Forces New Zealand, and Chief of the Army. Major Generals wear an insignia, with a pip above a crossed sword and baton. Above Major General, is the rank of Lieutenant General. A Lieutenant General is also known as a Three-Star General. This is the highest achievable rank for a serving member of the New Zealand Army. The rank of Lieutenant General is usually held by the Chief of the Defence Force. The CDF is the professional head of the Defence Forces and serves as the principal military advisor to the government. They are responsible for directing the Chiefs of Service and ensuring morale. The rank insignia of a Lieutenant General features a crown above a cross sword and baton. That's all for the ranks of the New Zealand Army. Did you know that about 105,000 men and women from New Zealand served overseas during the Second World War? Nearly 7,000 died on active army service and a total of over 11,000 in all services. Nearly 16,000 were wounded, but casualties were a much smaller proportion than in the First World War. If you didn't know this, you learnt it on the Military Stuff channel. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe and check out our other videos.